What's up, Hobby Maniacs? This is Mike Haspel here. I'm in uh, Dave Tishnai's uh, Beatles Lab in Chicago. We're uh, three days from Adepticon, and I'm working on my display board for my Space Wolves. So what I'm doing right now is we've cut a quarter piece of MDF uh, down. I'm going uh, two feet wide by 16, or uh, 16 inches um, long, or backwards, whatever. And I'm covering this up with uh, Vallejo gray pumice. Um, and it is essentially just pumice that's been crushed with like kind of a, a resin that reacts to air. You can do the same thing with spackle, you can even do the same thing with some uh, PVA glue and sand. But I'm in a hurry, so I just didn't want to mess around with that stuff. And this stuff is great, it cures to a really interesting kind of texture. And you can do stuff like this to give like a really kind of alien landscape. We're going to be adding, uh, after this is, has uh, cured and dried, we're going to be adding some um, we're gonna prime it and then we're gonna be adding some cork to do some kind of slate rocks and stuff like that to match the bases I have on my own. All right, uh, this is phase two. Uh, what I've done here is I've gone, I, I got some coverage on the entire uh, board there, on the MDF board, and I took um, this uh, paint applicator that I was using and to get this texture, what I started doing is just kind of banging it onto uh, the board like that and just pulling it up and it gives you a nice little spiky kind of alien landscape texture. And then what we've done is taken bits of cork and we're layering them on there. We're gonna obviously glue them down. And then uh, when we prime it black, we'll go back and dry brush and it'll look like uh, bits of shale. All right guys, this is um, a couple of stages past where we were on the display board. Um, as you can see, the uh, pumice hardened up really nice. It's getting some really good texture on it. All I'm doing is a dry brush. I airbrushed some brown on here because my bases have some brown integrated in it. This is uh, just cork that I've uh, dry brushed over. And now I'm gonna dry brush some white over just to bring out some of the details and make these ridges show up on the brown. Very, very light white dry brush. And, uh, and that'll be it, that'll be over. All right guys, here is the finished product. Uh, I've got my army sitting on the display board right now, and I'll pull a couple guys up so Dave can get in here and see um, what it looks like. This is just a very light white dry brush. I was going to add some snow flock, um, but I decided not to because with all the guys on here, you couldn't really see the uh, snow flock anyway. And I just got a border from Hobby Lobby, a uh, custom frame border, put it in here. This uh, piece of MDF just sits right in. and. Uh, there it is, you, and you can just pick it up and carry it, and it's a great display board, and it'll probably cost you all told maybe 25 bucks.